practice some more, let's build a triangular antiprism. So we would have the same idea, like with pentagonal antiprism, there would be triangle in the base and then three triangles in the sides. So let's do this. Here are two triangles for the sides and the third one. So here is the first side. Here it's one triangle for the side, second and the third one. And here it's two, oops, there is two and the third one. And there is last one for the base. Okay. So here we build triangular antiprism. But if we put this solid like this, we can recognize that it's also called something else. It is it can be called octahedron because it has eight equilateral triangles for it for sides. So it's an octahedron. But also we could call it square base by pyramid because we have those two mirror related pyramids that are superimposed on one another like this. So this solid has three names. It is a triangular antiprism, it is an octahedron and it is a square base by pyramid.